What's up, everybody? It's Chris again. Um, this one I acquired a uh, an older um, Fujitsu P1510D tablet just recently. Thought I would show it real quick. It does the whole rotating thing um, with XP tablet edition and the drivers for it and everything. It works. The display will switch properly and everything. But I decided to try to install Windows 7 just to see how it operates. Just installed all the updates, Windows updates, and um, everything's working except for when you switch it around or you try to rotate the screen. That's not work working. I and mean, that's just because I think the drivers, um, there's no drivers available, at least that I can find. And I didn't try searching too much. So uh, basically wanted to show you that the tablet function does work or the uh, touch display here and let's just say let's open up xchat and um, you know of course we can use the keyboard if we wanted to but this is a tablet so let's see let's see what our options are here if we click in there I think we can do keyboard here let me see yo and what's cool about this is with Windows 7 when I calibrated the screen it's working perfectly I can get to the edge just fine. With XP, every time I calibrated it, no matter what I did, when I clicked on the edge, it wouldn't hit the edge. It would be a little bit off. Um, but with Windows 7, it's it's perfect, actually. It works really nice. Now, with system resources, of course, it's running a little bit slow because the specs on this thing is only uh, 1.2 gigahertz Pentium M with maxed out RAM at 512 megs of RAM. But I just wanted to show you that um, it does work. Task manager here. We're running at about 331 megs of RAM being used. If we go into processes and task manager is using the most CPU at the moment, and then with RAM, it's Explorer. But um, anyways, for the most part, I mean, it's pretty. You can see it's pretty responsive. Uh, let's try opening up Internet Explorer. Okay, that opened up fairly quick. And Flash Player does work. I was watching some YouTube videos on this earlier. Um, let's see, what else? Uh, as far as Windows 7 goes, that's kind of the, the main thing. But again, none of these buttons work. I tried installing the drivers. It didn't work. Um, next up, I'm going to try Lubuntu, or L Ubuntu. And uh, I'll probably do a short video on that as well. But uh, everything works. Uh, wireless is connected right now. Audio is working. Um, pretty much out of the box with Windows 7. And you know what, in my opinion, the way it's running, it's running decent enough where I would can I would consider using Windows 7 on this thing if the display rotated. But again, I could probably find a solution somewhere, but uh, I'm not in the mood to dig around for all that. And the um, main thing I would use it for is IRC chat and then also to remote into our... Um, or my computer, or any other computers or servers I need to remote into. And just a real quick look around. Um, the battery's still good. It's an older laptop or tablet, but this battery's actually still good. Um, PCM, PCMCI slot, headphone, microphone, USB on the back here. Um, we got a display port, which I think, I haven't even opened it up yet. Yep, there's a display port in there. Um, we got RJ45 and modem. On this side we have a toggle switch for the Wi-Fi. Um, I'm not sure what that port is right there. If that's a bolt, duh. That's where our stylus goes. <laughs> um, got an SD slot and then another USB and a power. And then something right here which I don't... It's maybe the... I don't know what that's for. Maybe that's where your fingers go or something. And it, with XP, the fingerprint print scanner did work. Um, I would log in. I joined it to a domain and everything and I logged in using my finger using my fingerprint. Um, I haven't tried installing the drivers for Windows 7 because at this moment I'm not going to install anything that's going to take more resources. But anyways, just thought I'd give you a real quick demo of Windows 7 running on a really old tablet and for the most part working. Stay tuned for Lubuntu or El Ubuntu.